Hey, what's up, guys? It's Eli Fishman from TalkingBall.net and YouTube. Eli Fishman Sports here with MLB legend Tino Martinez. Tino, thank you so much for coming on today. My pleasure, Eli. Glad to be here. Thank you so much for coming on today. You played with many organizations in Major League Baseball. Is, do you feel that there is one that sticks out the most as the most special? Well, obviously, yes. The New York Yankees are um, above and beyond everybody else. It was a great honor for me to play in the Major Leagues for other teams that are first-class organizations. But as everybody knows throughout the country, the New York Yankees are one of the top sports organizations of all sports. And to play for them, to put on that uniform every day, uh, it's an honor, a tradition, and something that I just loved it. I loved it, all of it. In 1998, one of your most famous moments, Grand Slam in the World Series that gave the Yankees the lead. Can you talk to me about that moment, rounding the bases, got standing ovation, that entire moment, hitting the home run? Yeah, it was a, a, a great moment. Um, uh, I'll never forget it. I hit the, you know, hit the grand slam. I hit it. I knew it was gone. Uh, so I was able to enjoy it. It wasn't like one of those wall scrapers that barely gets over. So I knew it was gone. I was able to take a look at the fans and see the beer go flying and the people going crazy. And, and, and as I rounded first base, I just kept looking around. And that was just a, an amazing feeling that like I was walking on air, it seemed like. And uh, you know, I just hit a grand slam in the World Series. So uh, uh, awesome, awesome moment uh, you know, for the New York Yankees, for myself and the team, and uh, something I'll never forget. You played many years in Major League Baseball, and as you said, you were part of some of those amazing teams. And you know, you had seventy thousand fans following you around, being at the ballpark. As a human being, past that point, even though retired, what comes with you every single day of memories from that? You know, being a Major League Baseball player that affect you in everyday life. Yeah, I mean, you learn a lot. You learn a lot by playing Major League Baseball. You get to travel the world. You, you know, you, you meet a lot of friends everywhere, and uh, a lot of contacts and. Uh, but you learn. You learn how to, uh, you know, be part of a winning team, uh, what it takes, how to treat people uh, when they're going bad or good, uh, coaches you meet, everything. It's, it's just a life experience. And uh, uh, it was, like I said, it was an honor to play Major League Baseball for 16 years, but I'll never forget my time with the New York Yankees. And every time in New York, the fans there treat me so well that uh, it's just the greatest feeling in the world. You played in the Olympics in 1988 yes. in Seoul, Korea, you know, and you guys won gold, right? Yes, I did playing you know in the olympics which is the most the biggest sports event in all of everything uh to be to win gold with team usa team usa across your chest and just be a part of that team can you talk to me about playing in the olympics yeah it was fantastic uh you know we were all college players back then i think we were 18 19 years old and uh we had a really good team we had robin ventura jim abbott uh andy bennis uh ben mcdonald a bunch of a bunch of stars and uh we were able to play against uh, all these countries throughout the summer in, pre in preparation for the Olympics in Seoul. So we got to go to Japan for a couple of weeks. We got to go to Italy for a couple of weeks, uh, the whole United States. And then in late September was the Olympics. And, uh, you know, our goal was to win it. Back then in, in college, that was our World Series, you know, we representing our country. And uh, we wanted to show the world that we had the best baseball team. It's our sport. So we took a lot of pride in that. And we were able to finally win that gold medal. We beat Japan. And uh, it was just like winning the World Series back then. You played 16 years, an amazing MLB career. What was the best moment? Well, there's a lot of great moments uh, when I played for the Yankees because we won four World Series, and nothing can top the last outs. So when that guy, whoever caught the last out, uh, uh, Charlie Hayes uh, in the first one, I caught one from, from Brocious in 98. You know, Bernie caught one in center field against the Mets. Those last outs were the best feelings in the world because – you've accomplished your goal, which you set out to do in spring training. You know, from early on, your goal is to win the World Series. And to go through the, the entire season and finally get that last out was the greatest feeling in the world. All right, thank you so much for joining me.